Guard cadets becoming officers. It's surreal. It's so, so great to be surrounded by so many friends and family and faculty and staff too. More than 240 graduates from the U.S. Coast Guard Academy earning their diplomas and their officer titles, ready to serve and protect their country. Now that we're here and we're kind of part of it, it definitely feels like we've taken part in something bigger and more exciting than ourselves. It's the 142nd commencement ceremony at the Academy. The class of 2023 comes from dozens of states. 11 graduates are from right here in Connecticut and three are from international countries. The keynote speaker, U.S. Secretary of Homeland Security Alejandro Mayorkas, addressing the graduates, saying their class has been trained to make the world a better place. You will be leaders of people. Your charge will be to bring out the best in them, to inspire them, and to bring them together to work as one for the American people and our partners around the world. Families coming from all over to celebrate the class of 2023. An emotional day for many parents who say they're bursting with pride. It's amazing. So proud. Four years ago, we dropped him off with just a bag of underwear and socks. And, uh, and here he is graduating with these amazing men and women. Just extremely proud. For many of the new officers, the call to serve has always been in their hearts. A calling taking many of them right from graduation to sea. I knew I wanted to serve. I knew I wanted it to give back. Like, and this uh, was just an amazing way to do it. You. The cadets that now became officers after today's graduation ceremony get just a quick 30 day break before they head off to their new assignments to protect and serve our country. In New London, Lindsay Kane, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.